Okay, time to do some rink repair. Already started and realized I should get this unfilled. So here we are coming outside to the backyard rink where I've got my trusty hose and the trusty rink. Trying to fix, do some repair after all of the slushy rain this last week. So, give it a shot here. Well, it looks like it's water going out there. I do have some random pieces of tree crap in the rink. But it's under the ice, so it doesn't really matter. I like to give it a wide spray. I've got my home bony, which I'll use tomorrow when it's colder. I just wanted to get a little bit more water on here this time. So, you see it? Pretty exciting. All the layers. I have to get in the corners. There's my God made beaker, the big tree that we went around up here. It's amazing to see the different levels where I've got garden here of eight inches of board here, and you could skate off the edge there. But Kind of hard to see right now, but the kids shoot this direction while we've got the big softball baseball backstop there. So if they miss that, then they really have some bad shooting. Anyway, just thought I'd share the old uh, rink repair going on. So, with that, signing out. So last night you saw me put some water on the rink to try to smooth out after the slush. I wish I would have had all this recorded when it was slushing and raining and all that. But anyway, I was going to do a thin layer with my homemade Zamboni, but then it got a little dusting of snow overnight. So before I do anything else, I need to sweep off the snow. Otherwise, even this little bit of snow it turn into more slush if I add water, so that's my next step. After I do this, then tonight, once it's really cold, I can get the little Zamboni thingy out. So bear with me while I sleep. Ice rink maintenance is there's as much advice out there as there is for cold remedies or whatever ailment. Um, I guess it's really whatever works for you. This last step probably wasn't necessary, but for me, it lets me know where I've got some things I need to come back with a chopper and get some of these little bark pieces out that were on top. Must have been in the water after my last slush removal, I guess. So I can see a lot of them in the rink, in the ice. This big huge tree, and the squirrels like to, I don't know, there's squirrels, and there's a woodpecker up there that likes to shoot stuff down on us. So, anyway, there's a bunch of little bark pieces in the ice, but I thought they were all way down deep, but there are a few that are 
frozen in the surface so I'll have to chop those out quick before I come back with my uh, home bony. So with that I'll be back later with the little bit of water treatment and see how that goes. It's going to be a really cold night tonight so I want to get that in before bedtime tonight so overnight um, it should smooth the rest of this out really nicely. Well, I am going to take the old ice chopper and get some of these surface pieces out before I do the next step. Not a lot of them. that stuff up. treatment well for the sake of being adaptable of good plans don't always work if you've done the Super Bowl halftime show for the sake of using my thumb my uh oh interrupted does she need to get her gear on yes what time are you leaving her practice at 510 so we'll leave at 4 45. All right, back to the old trusty hose. Now, I do, I'm just gonna put a thin layer of water before I come over it with the Zamboni, just to smooth it out, that's it. plan to show you how nice the rink was but what happens is what always seems to happen after I touched up is we get some snow but I will do my best and forgive the attire today I 
did not necessarily dress for the morning here. Okay. So let's look and see what we have. Yep. It might be hard to see, but underneath this little tiny dusting of snow, this ice is actually nice and smooth, which is what I had hoped. I'll go out a little. Oops. That's not a room. I'll go out a little bit further here. Yeah, it's kind of cloudy looking from that slush last month, but the ice itself is is good and smooth. You can see these leaves and tree materials I was talking about that are embedded, but they're down inside, so they're fine. Otherwise, it's nice and nice and smooth. So slush, slush repair fix complete.